we are saying that all right if the voter of maharashtra this time was sick with this jod tod marod okay then they are probably going to lean towards one of the national parties so actually the by that logic you should see the bjp and the congress both their vote shares go up slightly does that a stable government make don't know okay now let's rope in the other one priya uh, the pawars yes okay now my gosh in the everybody knew i mean you know this better than i do you've been doing this longer than i have right so supriya was at the center in delhi looking after things there and ajit was one looking after things in maharashtra okay as the right. power base was he was the man on the on you know taking care carders campaigning baramati was also ajit pawar was looking after okay and supriya was handling things in delhi that's what she was being groomed for for the better part of 20 years all right but then sharad pawar changes his mind why Ajit Pawar changes it for him. You know, uh, Ajit Pawar felt insecure. He thought that he was not getting his time. Perhaps uh, also the look at what happened. You know, there were coalition governments. Uh, there was a lesser chance of uh, you know um, uh, uh, NCP really getting a toe in the center. So Sharad Pawar, as all the opposition parties have now seen that their best bet is at the state level. That is why Ajit Pawar felt insecure, and he felt that his this arrangement is not going to work. And Sharad Pawar is going to impose Supriya Sule perhaps at the state level. She is his heir apparent. Sharad Pawar had. also aged he said again this time round this is my last battle if it you know he's an octogenarian how much more can he go another election at the best so in that sense the time had come for sharad pawar to set his house in order and he began doing it by giving supriya sule uh, more heft in than ajit pawar as is natural you know father and daughter equation so that is why ajit pawar felt insecure secondly i think there was the ed cases also that uh, had their own tell uh, in praful patel and ajit pawar that part of the conversation we've heard playing out in the elections also so that also had its uh, fair share of play i think in terms of the ncp okay. oh. and thirdly without sharad pawar rishab there is no ncp you know supriya sule is very good but she is there because of sharad pawar yes. while ajit pawar without sharad pawar can still make a difference or not is to this is the election that will tell us yes so ajit pawar can probably hang in he can he can hold on a few seats even before without sharad pawar supriya sule cannot let's be realistic okay uh so okay let's absorb some details that are coming in because yes so we get to watch live results from maharashtra 15 leads being reported out 288 early stages the bjp leading in 7 the congress in 3 uh eknath shinde himself is leading in his constituency aditya thakre meanwhile is leading in verli where he's taking on uh of course milin diora of the other side of the shiv sena in zishan sadiki after having joined the new party is leading in vandre also known as bandra uh the ncp of ajit pawar leading in two the ncp of sharad pawar leading in one the shiv sena ubt leading in one on the top of your screens in uh, jharkhand it is the jmm that has taken the early two leads uh the reporting feedback from from there might be a bit slower even though there are less votes and less evms to count in jharkhand meanwhile there's an epic battle going